What's up guys, my name is Michael and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to do another problem called Will It Ever Stop on Spodge? Basically, uh, Bob has his code and then you're just asking will it ever stop? And this is the code. Um, while n is greater than 1, if n mod 2 is equal to 0, then we divide it by 2. Else we multiply by 3 and add by 3. Help him find it out soon. Okay, so this is actually not that difficult. Um, if you just plug in a bunch of numbers, you'll actually see the pattern of this problem. So basically, if it's a if it's a power of two, right? If it's a power of two, so here you're just basically checking if it's a power of two, right? Because um, here if we had like if n is equal to eight, it's going to divide eight by two, which gets you four. And then because uh, four is even, if n mod two is equal to zero, right? This checks if it's even. If n mod 2 is equal to 0, right, that checks if it is even, um, then 4 divided by 2 is 2, and then 2 divided by, and then after the loop again, uh, 2 divided by 2 is 1, so then this this would stop. So it will only stop when it's a power of 2, right? Because if it's not a power of 2, let's say it was like, um, I don't know, uh, let's say it was, I don't know, uh, so, 18 or something. Wait, is that a power 2? Yeah, 18. Let's say it was 18. 18 is even, right? So we divide by 2, which gets you 9. Then um, then this else statement is going to make it um, 9 plus 9 times 3 gets you 27 plus 3 gets you 30. And that's going to increase increase the number of n to become 30 and then you get uh 30 divided by 2 is 15 and then it because it's still not divisible by uh, it's still not a power 2 right it's going to do f 3 times 15 gets you 45 plus 3 will get you 48 so yeah the, the loop will just never end at that point it'll just never stop right so all you have to do is just based on this code is just check if it's a power 2 or not and if it is then you just Print out TAC if it is, uh, otherwise print out NIE. And here's how you check if it's a power 2. So here I read in the number N that uh, that we're doing in this code, right? And I just check, uh, I take the log base of 2 and gets gets me this uh, long value. Then I just check if the power of 2 to this long value of my answer is equal to, equal to N. Then that's a power of 2, right? No, we know it's a power of 2. Then we print out TAC, otherwise we print out NIE. And the reason why this works is because, um, let's say you have 16, right? So if I take the log base of 2 of 16, it'll get me 4. So then this is the same thing as doing 2 to the 4 is equal to 16. Right, so I'm checking. So after when I take log base 2 of 16, I get 4. Then what I'm doing is I'm taking 2 and I'm raising it to a power of 4 to get me. And I'm checking if it's equal to 16. So if it's equal to the original number that we had before, after taking log base 2 of it and then raising it again, then it is a power of 2. Otherwise, it's not a power of 2. So yeah, that's pretty much it. That's pretty much the gist of the question. Hope you guys enjoyed this short video. Rate, comment, subscribe. I'll check you guys later. Peace.